What may look like a winter wonderland turned into what Lexington City Manager Noah Simon called a snow emergency. Over Friday and Saturday, the Rockbridge area received between 16 and 20 inches of snow, effectively shutting it down. Schools, city and county offices, and many downtown businesses closed. Some, like Taps and Mono Taqueria, decided to remain open. I think that after 4 o'clock, when people start stirring around, it'll be crazy here, because everybody else is closed. We're, we're going to be in good shape. Clark Hyman, like several others, believes the county handled the snowstorm better than recent years. That's because Lexington City Council banned parking downtown, which allowed snowplows to better move through the streets. I think this year is amazing what they're doing because they've, uh, you can't park on the streets anymore. You know, uh, they'll tow you away. One of the guests over here got towed away. But um, last year when we had the 18 inches, everybody got buried in. This year it's totally different. I mean, they're on top of their game. The county's Spencer Suter said the snow removal was a success because the city, county, and VDOT were all working together for the first time. Simon said that although Lexington's plows are old, they are in working condition. Plows were attached to the front of trucks and even four-wheelers. Despite this, many roads outside of the Lexington city limit remained unplowed, and some of the ones in the city still had a layer of sludge on them, making driving conditions dangerous. Simon said that overall, the city dealt with the snow very well. He was pleased with the plan and the implementation. And if Lexington were to receive another snowfall similar to this one, he wouldn't do anything differently. Although snow is removed from the roads quickly and efficiently, sidewalks remain snowy and icy for the next several days. In the Rockbridge Report, I'm Kylie Sapp.